in this problem see a small metal ball is being pulled gradually on a frictionless hemisphere as shown radii of the ball and that of the pulley are much smaller than so it's the ball is almost a point mass how do the magnitude of the pulling force and contact force are between the ball and the hemisphere change now if you look at the forces so let me draw it again this one this is the hemisphere there is the pulley and this between the pulley and the center of the hemisphere this is a fixed distance and let's take this ball here so this is a force and this pulley is uh, very small actually this is a these are the forces on the ball mg and the other one is a normal reaction R. Okay, so sum of the three forces equal to zero. So we will draw a triangle, vector triangle. See, look at. Uh, I'll just mark these angles. Say this angle is theta one, theta two, and say theta three. You know. So now, you see in this vector triangle, these are the same angles theta two, theta one, and theta three, because the force this mg. See that, so these two are parallel, right? See this, this force, r force, and this radius. So this is the force r. now if you look at this uh, this distance uh, i mean the line joining the center of the pulley to center of the hemisphere this is in the direction of this force mg and uh, third one this force f is this is also force f so this string the string joining the ball to the the uh, string joining the ball to the center of this pulley Right, the force F is directed around that string, so this is the force F in the diagram. So this force. F. So we see a real triangle, a real triangle and a vector triangle. So what is the real triangle? I will just name the points. This is B for the ball, C for the center of the hemisphere, and A for the center of the pulley. So the ABC. the so triangle abc and the vector triangle shown above are similar so hence you see that as they are similar and is uh, this uh, distance ac is constant and distance bc is constant so this mg is constant so is the normal reaction constant so it is been asked that how do the magnitude of the pulling force and the contact force change so here f decreases so as you see that this on this side ab decreases right as side ab decreases so this force f decreases so r remains and this side bc remains same so this reaction normal reaction for r also remains same so the correct option will be option c